Groundwater contamination has been discovered beneath this fire academy training ground just off Sheep Davis Road in Concord. Tests conducted by the Department of Environmental Services earlier this year revealed perfluorochemical or PFAS pollution. We've seen some preliminary testing from our staff has shown fairly high levels in that immediate area. PFAS is common in certain kinds of firefighting foam. The Fire Academy says it has used that foam on this site through approximately 175 training courses dating back to 1994. As awareness has increased about PFAS as an emerging contaminant of groundwater supplies, the Department of Safety flagged this as an area of potential concern. It's an isolated spot, and officials say there is no known threat to drinking water. There's no health uh, impact to the uh, staff or the community surrounding the grounds, and that's our largest concern. Still, the state is hiring an outside engineering firm to conduct further tests, and the fire academy has switched to a different foam. We ceased using uh, the foam that had PFOA or PFOS in it in May of 2018. Uh, a fluorine-free foam has been selected under the guidance of the Department of Environmental Services. As the work begins to determine the full extent of the contamination here, Executive Counselor Andrew Valinsky commends the proactive approach and says it should be applied to other sites as well. I think we need to think generally where are the places where this kind of material has been used in fire suppression efforts and training for fire suppression around the state and we need to proactively go to each of those sites and do similar kinds of testing. In Concord, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.